guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, naranasan nyo na bang maging homeless guys? Or may nakikita kayong mga homeless sa kalsada? Paano kung sa ibang bansa guys, kagaya ng may, win may winter? Yun, nag yellow At pag nakita mo silang matatanda na, ugod-ugod na, anong... Anong mararamdaman nyo guys? So ngayon, yun yung pagre-reaction na natin guys. So isang reaction video na naman ito. At uh, panoorin natin guys ano ang laman ng video na ito. So ayan guys, start na natin panoorin. A waste ground on the outskirts of the Polish capital, Warsaw. 58-year-old Stanisław is homeless. For more than two decades, this ladder has been the way he gets to his hangout, five meters underground in a heating duct. Around a dozen people live here, taking advantage of the heat given off by pipes that pump 100-degree water around Warsaw. We can wash here, clean our clothes, and even do our ironing. If we put some eggs in a pan, fill it with boiling water, and stick it on a pipe, they'll cook. Surviving in such conditions is risky, however. This man fell several meters and landed on his head. He was lucky to escape with just cuts and bruises. Several months ago, in the same place, another man died. The residents' top priority is to stick together. They can also count on hot meals handed out by the local police. They say there's no question if they're going into a shelter where alcohol is banned and the timetable is strict. From 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. they throw us out and we can't leave any of our stuff here. How am I supposed to find a job? Here at least I'm free. The ducts crisscross Warsaw and pump hot water from communist-era coal-fired central heating plants to homes and offices. They are also part of an alternate world populated by several thousand homeless people. 40-something Gosha has already spent a third of her life underground. She ended up homeless after a painful divorce and floods in her community, but the worst was yet to come. A few years ago I gave birth to a little girl down in the duct. I had a big red bucket and I brought her into the world. Then I wrapped her in a sheet and went up to call the emergency services. You actually gave birth alone, without any help? Yes. Gosha handed her daughter over to a Warsaw foster family of her own free will. Today she's trying to get by amid a vicious cold snap which has claimed several dozen lives, with most of the victims homeless. Nakaawa sila guys, ano? Matatanda na sila kung, kung magulang ko ganon, hindi ko kayang panuurin. Wala silang bahay. Tapos, bakit saan kaya yung mga anak nila? So, may ganun pala guys, ano. Um, pero may tumutulong pa rin sa kanila guys. May parang nagbibigay sa kanila ng pagkain, ano. Ayan. So, naawa ako kasi ang tanda na wala. Basta, na, nakaawa talaga. So, kung ano pong reaction nyo guys, pakisulat sa baba. At uh, sa la, mga bagong viewers dyan, please subscribe to my channel. <laughs> and uh, give me thumbs up guys. And share. Thanks for watching. Bye!